Born in Steading Shangtai, Loyal was the son of Elder Arendt, a leader of the Ogier, and Kovril, a famous speaker known throughout their society and beyond. A long-lived and highly rational people who rarely left their homelands, the Ogier were slow and thorough, carefully studying their options before reaching a decision, with speakers sometimes summoned to a great stump where important issues were debated. For this reason, Loyal stood out among the Ogier as he was considered irresponsibly hasty, with some elders remarking that he acted an hour before he thought. A gifted tree singer, able to encourage and manipulate the growth of plant life, his father pressured him to take this talent seriously and dedicate himself entirely to this pursuit, but Loyal preferred to explore other interests as well, most especially his love of reading and writing. Nearing the age of 90, considered young by Ogier standards, Loyal feared the loss of his freedom as his mother was preparing to marry him off. Although females were free to decline a marriage proposal, males took the more passive roles in relationships, and thus, while single, were forced to abide by the decisions of their mothers, and once married, were subject to the desires of their wives. However, Loyal wished to travel and see the wider world before settling down, and so left the steading without permission, embarking upon a journey into human lands, where he met and befriended Randall Thor, a farmer's son on his own unique adventure, which ultimately saw him named the Dragon Reborn, a prophesied hero destined to lead the fight against the wicked armies of Shadowspawn in the last battle. Deciding to join Rand and his companions throughout their travels, Loyal became a valuable member of the company with a reputation for loyalty, bravery, and heroism in the face of increasing dangers. Much to his surprise, Loyal became involved in events of unimaginable importance, as his new friends found themselves at the center of a great and widespread conflict that included a terrible blight spreading across the Westlands. While the Forsaken gathered monstrous armies in the name of their god, the Dark One Shaitan. Using his knowledge of the ways, secret passages used to travel between steadings, originally gifted to the Ogier by male Aes Sedai during the Age of Legends, Loyal helped his companions move about quickly and quietly throughout the Westlands, all the while documenting their adventures in the hopes of authoring a book about all he'd seen and experienced. Throughout this great journey, Loyal met a nim named Someshta, also known as the Green Man, a famous creature among the Ogier who died while destroying the forsaken Balthamel. Deeply moved after witnessing this noble sacrifice, Loyal sang a song of enchantment which created a magical barrier around the Green Man's remains to protect it from the blight fast approaching. Though Loyal was in many ways a rebel within Ogier society, he did share some traits in common with his people, including his love of forests and plant life, as well as his gentle demeanor and abhorrence for violence. Yet as he traveled with his companions, the dangers around them were too great to ignore, and so Loyal found himself fighting alongside his allies in the Battle of Emmons Field, defending their homeland from a Trollic invasion and the Battle of Dumai's Wells, where they rescued Randall Thor from enemy Aes Sedai. When Shadowspawn started using the ways to travel quickly throughout the lands, Loyal underwent a mission to visit every steading he could, informing the Ogier of the approaching danger, leading many to start guarding these passages, while others chose to ignore his warnings. Eventually, Loyal's activities and growing reputation reached the ears of his mother Kovril, who believed him a silly child partaking in nonsense. Therefore, she left Steading Shangtai and tracked him down in order to force his marriage to a female named Aerith. Though Loyal was apprehensive about the arrangement, in truth, he always had feelings for Aerith, and so quickly came to enjoy being her husband. During the reunion with his mother, Loyal learned that their people were gathering at the Great Stump to discuss the war being waged against the Dark One, where, much to his disappointment, his own mother was arguing against participation in favor of opening the Book of Translation, which meant abandoning humanity to their fate. Though the Ogier lived in these lands for thousands of years, they were originally from another world, having used the Book of Translation to transport their people. Therefore, some believe the time had come for the Ogier to once again open the book and relocate to save themselves from the threat of this monumental war. 
although Loyal was not a gifted speaker like his mother, preferring to write his thoughts. His new wife encouraged him to bring his arguments to the Great Stump, where he spoke against opening the book, so they might take up arms against the darkness and fight alongside the armies of light. To the surprise of many, his simple eloquence was enough to sway the Ogier, who then fought in the last battle of Tarmin Gaiden, helping the forces of his friend Randall Thor, now widely recognized as the Dragon Reborn, to defeat the Shadow Spawn and banish the Dark One. Surviving the war, Loyal became a scholar and released his book, The Dragon Reborn, as an account of all he witnessed. 